Traveling to the red state of Louisiana, President Biden made a push for his massive infrastructure proposal using the backdrop of a bridge that's past its prime. These are the highest values and investments you can make as a nation. And they last the longest. After receiving a poor inspection rating, the I-10 Calcasieu River Bridge is undergoing a replacement project paid for in part through tolls. The president argues his plan would help with a $115 billion funding increase proposed to modernize bridges and roads. This state is working to rebuild the I-10 bridge, but we can put America to work in every state, fixing roads and bridges that are in desperate need of repair. The president's proposal also allocates more than $100 billion dollars for water infrastructure, which he plans to highlight later at a New Orleans water plant. Louisiana is the fourth state the president has visited over the span of a week as part of his Getting America Back on Track tour to sell his jobs and families plan as well as the proposed tax hike to pay for them. This is all about making a choice, a choice between giving tax breaks to super wealthy and to corporations and investing in working families. Congressional Republicans say undoing the Trump era tax cuts are a non-starter, but they're open to compromise on an infrastructure bill. We've laid out about a $600 billion alternative. So we'll see whether we can reach an agreement. In agreement, Senate Minority Leader Mitch McConnell will likely discuss next week when he and other top congressional leaders meet with President Biden.